Hey everybody, this is going to be a very quick video on how to set up SSL certs on a web application hosted on your local host. I was doing some testing on my local environment and I just needed to have my web application run on HTTPS. So in order to do that, I just needed to have some local SSL certs. So this is going to be a really quick video and I hope you enjoy. Okay, so if we look at the site that I have on my local host, you can see that it's on HTTP. If I try to set it up to HTTPS, you'll see that it won't work. You see unable to connect, so let's go back. So first let's change into the root user to make our lives a little bit easier. And the certs that I'm gonna create, I'm gonna put them in the, these folders over here, which would be the certs and the private. So I'm gonna just go to the Etsy SSL certs really quick. All right, so let's run this command to request the certs. It's going to make a key that's going to be called mylocalhost.key and then a PIM file, which is going to be called mylocalhost.pim. And you can fill these out with whatever. These are just going to be local, so it doesn't really matter too much. And right here, I'm just going to put localhost. All right, and if we look, we can see that we have the two files created right here. And now we're going to copy each of them to their respective folders. The first one being the key file to the private folder, and then the .pem file to the certs folder. And now we can enable SSL. And now we're going to modify the SSL configuration file for Apache. And we're basically going to point it to the two um, files that we just created, the key and the pem file. I'll be using the Vim editor, but you can use whichever text editor you like. Um, if you're using Vim to search through it, just press the slash and we're gonna be looking for SSL certificate file. There we go. Press escape, I'm gonna go down, I to insert, and I'm gonna comment these two out just in case I ever need them. You can also create a backup file if you like before making the edits. Um, and once you're ready to edit the file, just insert these two lines. basically what we're doing is we're just pointing the SSL file, SSL certificate file to the PIM uh, location and then the SSL certificate key file to the uh, key file location. And once you're done, you can quit and save. So just escape semicolon or uh, colon WQ for write and quit. And now we can enable it on the site. First we'll change directories. And then we'll run the a 2 insight command, passing the file that we just configured right over here. And now we just restart our Apache service. And now whenever we reload our, or sorry, now whenever we go to HTTPS, you will get this warning site just because the cert isn't officially issued by a certificate authority. Um, these are local uh, certificates, so that's why you get these um, warnings. Uh, pressing accept and then accept again, uh, you'll see that you're now able to go to the HTTPS site. And that's pretty much it. So pretty simple uh, steps to do. Um, it was just something I needed to do on my local environment. Thought I'd share it because I had to do some Googling for it. Um, and maybe it'll save you some time. So thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe.